All right, good morning guys. So this morning we're doing something a little bit different. Um, what we're going to do, so earlier this year we started out on bikes in Florida. But now, don't know how well you can see that, but uh, we're gonna try the old kayak trick. All right, well, we're finally in here. Man, that is some of the thickest I've ever been through. Excuse my language, the thickest stuff I've ever been through. God almighty. So I just called. <clears throat> and I think I had one gobble way off. So when I said this morning that I came through some really thick stuff, I'm going to show you guys just how thick and what I'm talking about. Now if I don't get this just right, I'm going to have to fight through this to try to find my kayak. I just went knee deep in a freaking mud hole. Good news is, I crossed this tree this morning, so I know I'm on the right path. Alright, we made it. Now just to pack up and head home. Good morning guys. Another beautiful morning. to see me move my head. But I didn't think I moved my head that much, but man, it's so still in here. and so open.
snakes are really out in force. I think this is number six or seven for today. That's now two days in a row that I have not heard a bird, or seen a bird, or been on a bird whatsoever. That hasn't happened since April 3rd or April 4th. Whatever my second day on the second trip of Florida was. I've been on a bird, or heard a bird gobble, every single day since then. And today is May 20th. That's a pretty good run. Because I've hunted every day since then, but three, I think. And then tonight is my last night at work until we head north. Running a little bit late. I have now been up for 25 hours and uh, we're going back hunting. I really hope that I uh, pull the trigger on a long beard this morning. Well, Day three, no gobbles.